Hello everyone, welcome back to the Steel Donut Collective. My name is Yellow. With me today I have a Matt. Hey, I'm Matt. A Connor. Hello there. And Bob. This is my final intro line. And we are back on wikihow.com for all the information, all the tutorials. Matt surely has a problem. I don't care. The solution oh, is what? that he oh. needs to find a good place to start skateboarding. Yeah. Really? Because my problem was like something completely unrelated to skateboarding. I don't care, Matt. Oh, okay. I don't right. give well, a shit. We're not fixing that today. Okay, <laughs> well, I guess I'll learn how to find a good place to skateboard then. Yeah, yeah, that was okay. another problem you had, Surely right? that'll Good. help fix my divorce problem. Yeah, yeah well, mm -hmm. it's okay. Can't get enough divorces? That's yeah. fine. We'll sort that sort that out later. I need more yeah. divorces. Finding, <laughs> finding a good place to skateboard can be tricky. Most <laughs> cities have... Oh, it's, a, it's a comedy. Maybe they should become okay, a comedy fun, master. Very fun. I like it. Golf clap. Golf Most clap. cities have strict laws against skateboarding in public areas or on government property. To make things uh -huh. worse, some skaters are jealous of their skate spots <laughs> and won't share them. I, are you sure jealous is the word you wanted to go with? Don't think that's what that well, word is. Uh, yeah, I, mean, I don't think that's how you use that, no. Maybe, no. maybe it is. If I'm not good enough for you, then no one can have a <laughs> skate spot. <laughs> Yeah, I don't think jealous is the right word there. However, with a little patience and effort, you can find an amazing place in no time. Nice. True enough. Oh, man. And they also, have they have updated uh, WikiHow uh, a little bit since I've last been here, but not significantly yeah. so that you won't be able to to navigate, I yeah. think. They've, but they, they added like the download article some, button. They have a download article button now, and they have some like navigation tools up at the top, which I don't remember seeing before. Yeah, yeah so I don't remember that's that. which is nice. You know, that's that's an improvement. Good yeah, job. Yeah, I don't have to guess where what's coming where now. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Mm -hmm. All right. Well, method one: finding a place to learn now, out in the void. You can just do <laughs> it out in the in the gray and brown void. <laughs> yeah. So normally, it's is that like, a shadow oh. or did, is it just really wet right there? <laughs> <laughs> I think. Like I, you know what I think his skateboard is smoking because it's uh, yeah. The engine is dying. <laughs> He's going so his fast. Skateboard's on fire. Oh, I was thinking it's because his engine was was malfunctioning. Oh yeah, he should get that looked at. Absolutely. Yeah. Yeah. Also, yeah. his engine. his arms freak me out, kind of. Kids, if your skateboard is smoking, you have to take it down to the shop. Okay, you might have something wrong with it, and yeah. it might not mm -hmm. ride anymore after yeah. a while. <sighs> yeah. And I mean, I understand that it's like it's fun, you know, to take your skateboard apart. But really, if it's smoking like that, you should see a professional. And I mean, Yella, uh, kids these days, you know, skateboarder kids have evolved so that their arms are longer so they can do sweet grabs. Even. Exactly. Oh, exactly. Yeah. yeah. The next sense. evolution of skateboarding is duo skateboarding, where two two people skateboard next to each other and they do grabs on each other's boards. Yeah. Oh, and you have to have really long arms. For you that. have to have really long arms. Like for synchronized that. skating tricks. Yeah. Exactly. Yeah. Actually, mm. real shit. That would be incredible. It would be. Yeah. <laughs> I mean, like imagine. Like Antonio Hawk and Antonio Hawk two, uh, mm, yeah, Hawk right harder. next to each other, and then like they swap boards midair. Oh, that would actually be dope as hell. Yeah, it'd be incredible. Find a city approved skate spot. Mm. <laughs> All right, how to find a good place to start skateboarding? Find a skateboarding spot. Yeah, if you're yeah. a square, the city, is put down. city approved. Okay, public skate park or something. Yeah. These days, many larger cities are building free skate parks by repurposing industrial areas. Is that how that For works? For example, <laughs> the city of Arlington, Texas, is in the process of building 15 skating spots around the city. Wow, thanks well, for that tidbit. That's <laughs> cool for people uh, who nice. live in Arlington. Cool and good. <laughs> These skate parks are approved spots for skaters to practice tricks and learn to skate. <laughs> what else would you be doing there? No, 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 no. Matt, Matt. Matt. The, different, the, pro the thing is, these skate parks are for practicing your tricks. Oh, I and see. And then you leave the skate park to do the tricks everywhere oh, I was going to say, like, uh, uh, can I do the tricks there, too? or is These are is just, just practice like, zones. Just a practice zone. I'm not a Well, if I land the trick, is it still practicing it? Uh, as or long do as I have you're to like, go in there, board. and if I land the trick, they kick me out. No, as long as you have a padded board, it's fine. Oh, I see. Okay. I mean, guys, have you ever seen like a pro skating video put out by you know Thrasher or whatever that's entirely just at these public places? No, no. because no, that's yeah. just practice. Those don't count. That's true. Yeah, cool that's skateboarding true. moves. Yeah. Right. Right. Uh, mm. Yeah. So 
Talk to a local government representative or do an internet search to find a skate. I, I feel like one of those is much easier than the other. Yeah. Hmm. Which should one I do you call think up my local happen? government representative or should I search Google for a skate park? Yeah. <laughs> representative Davids, or can I please skate here? <laughs> Son, I, I, I got other shit to do. Skate spot, please. <laughs> I, I am have a to congressperson. Say, guys, notice. That at the end of the sentence, there's a little, you know, reference thing. This is uh-huh. expert source. Oh. This expert co-author. John, I, John D- DePoen wanted DePoen. me to talk to my local representative. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. All right. Yes. <laughs> Congressman Joe Wilson, please, I need a skate park. I'm begging you. <laughs> That's how he found out where to go skate. Yeah. And now he's an expert. Yeah. Uh, if you skate in these spots, you don't have to worry about approaching cars or getting in trouble for trespassing. <laughs> City approved cars. skate spots are great places to meet other skaters who can help you learn to skate. Mm-hmm. Oh, and yeah, the skate park is not an ideal location if you're new to skateboarding and you're still learning how to ride on flat surfaces. I, so you know, why is it I, the first tip? I, why I, is it a skate park? Learn. And I'll have you know there was plenty of flat surfaces when I went there, asshole, okay? <laughs> I don't know what fucking skate park you went to that had zero flat surfaces, but there see, was like an entire thinking, little area for it. See, I was even thinking like, okay, so... The skate park's not an ideal location if you're new to skateboarding. Maybe because other people will be skating there, and it's, like, dangerous for you to be in the way. But oh, like, okay. Then where the fuck are you supposed to learn to skateboard? In your they basement? Even, oh, I thought he said they didn't have flat surfaces there, and I'm realizing it's maybe, for learning flat surfaces. But, it like, it says if you're still learning how to ride on flat surfaces, which... Doesn't imply that they do or don't have flat surfaces. Yeah, yeah, there. yeah. I misread that. I, oh, also, I do like the the specificity of you don't have to worry about approaching cars. Approaching yeah. cars makes it seem like the cars are very slowly creeping yeah, towards no, they're coming skateboarding. To you. They're like JoJo <laughs> posing out to you. Yeah. Okay, uh, oh, you were approaching me, car. Like you're not. Wor- they're not actually going to hit you. No, they're, they're not moving very fast, but they are very just creeping up to you. They're standing there menacingly. Yeah. <laughs> so this next picture really highlights why I wanted to cover this article. <coughs> oh my god, what the fuck? Are they snowboarding? Yeah, there's a lot going on here. Okay, and it's yeah. like Okay, you know what? Like I was drawn to the skateboard without wheels. And then while I was looking at it, I noticed that the park bench was missing. Yeah, oh, no, was missing a, another support. Leg. And while I was looking uh. at that, I noticed that all the fucking bushes are just smears. Yeah, they're also, just notice spray that can. They're- there's a lot to notice, God. They're like, all just they're, smears. They didn't even fucking try. No, it's not even like it's vaguely bush-shaped, I guess, or that there is any sort of texture to it or whatever. No, it's, it's just, just a, a spot. Opened up MS Paint, clicked on the spray paint tool, called it a fucking day. Now, question. Do we have to concede to them that those are bushes? Because I think they're green ghosts. Oh, you know what? I'll take that. <laughs> they yeah. might just be green they're, ghosts. They're the green ghosts of skateboarders. That's past Slimer's back there. extended family <laughs> hanging out with you and your snowboard. <laughs> your city snowboard. And my fucked up bench. What is behind the bench? I can't tell what I that is. I don't know what that is. Just that's a random... uh, you know, that's a, that's a curb that they decided to not continue. Yeah. Yeah. Where did they trace this from? There's no way they drew this. They traced this some from Some of it something. seems traced, and some of it seems like MS Paint, and some of it seems like... I don't even know. I mean, like, the building's, like, lines seem her- really warped and, like... Yeah. Is her thumb a different color? Yeah. I mean, that's the inside that of it. Thumb? Like, that's the palm. I think that's the palm side. Oh, I, I thought she was holding, like, car keys or something. Yeah, it seems a little strange. Number two, go to your local high school. Most high schools have parking lots, long handrails, ramps, stairs, and large concrete areas outside of the school building. These better hope the you're ramps. outside the school. Yeah. <laughs> ramps, yeah. yeah. Uh, these features are perfect for a budding skateboarder. If possible, ask for permission to skateboard in advance. <laughs> if it's possible to ask for permission, do it. Otherwise, don't even bother. I've never yeah. seen a high school that doesn't ban skateboarding. Yeah, I was going to say, like, yeah. every single local high school around where I live has no skateboarding signs up. Yeah. yeah. If a security like, guard asks you to leave, do so. If you get hurt on someone's property, they may be legally liable. <laughs> right, that that's the reason I, I should leave, because I care about that. 
That I'd... is literally the reason. <laughs> <laughs> well, I'll skate on Saturdays and Sundays to avoid crowds. I guess. Uh, thank you. I will do what you tell me. <laughs> thank you. Yeah. I mean, also yes. to be fair, if you're if you're okay, if you're younger than high school age, you should probably just be in school. If you're in high school, you should be in school. If you're older than high school age. They're probably not going to let you hang out at the high yeah, don't school, let, bro. Well, yeah, like, no high school, crowds of high schoolers don't want you hanging around. The, nobody else wants you hanging around well, the high school either. Old, yeah, it doesn't matter. Yeah, like, the, they're not going to let you anywhere near there <laughs> unless you have business being there. Like, they will probably, if you're an adult there hanging out, they will probably also ask you to leave. Not because yeah. you're skateboarding, but because you're too old to be here. <laughs> yeah, you're like a, a random adult they don't know hanging out at this high school. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> you could be handing out church flyers and they not... Well, no, no, I mean, that, that makes sense, actually. Grow up and go, you know, run away from the security guards trying to stop you from skateboarding downtown like the yeah. rest of the adults are. Yeah. yeah. Come on. And then if the, you go turn a corner, and then the guy comes around the corner, and you slam him in the face with a skateboard, and you just kick the shit out of him. Yeah. yeah. Just like me and Connor used to do, back in yeah. the good old days, when I could <laughs> uh, walk. Yeah. Uh-huh. <laughs> and I tried to skateboard. Yeah. Now uh, we just do yeah. it on the internet. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. You'd hope I'd have many stories, but they're actually, they're mostly about me falling down when trying to skateboard. And I'm that, not very good. And that time you, like, the kid with the bicycle. Well, that's over a bike, the, not a skateboard. Yeah. yeah. I've well, modified I have a few more bike stories, it's got an but X this is about skateboarding. It's BMX. That's extreme. Well, see, in my yeah. head, I've morphed that story so much that I don't even remember the original <laughs> story. In my oh. head, it's a story about you driving a car and then skidding into a child who, like, flies over telephone wires and his bike gets caught up there. That's the um, story I remember, which I know to be entirely a fabrication. <laughs> I feel like you are baiting me into retelling what the story actually is. A little bit, but video. also, I, I mean, did I get any part of that right? Not really. Okay. Uh, <laughs> okay. I was on my bike. Uh, I went to the bike park. I tried to do a 180. And that's when I, I hit a kid who was going by. But it was on a BMX bike. And, like, he didn't go flying. He just got knocked down and I got kicked out. Would they kick oh. you out for that? I I mean, you know. It's one of those things where, like, all of us nowadays are like, oh, my God, that kid should have, you know, watched where he was going. But, you know, I caused a crying child and all that shit. And it was just like... They yeah. kicked you yeah. out for that. Wow. And, the, and you, can, you can see how the story morphed from his to mine, right? Yeah. Mm-hmm. It's called embellishment. I mean... <laughs> it's called embezzlement. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> okay. <laughs> oh, I'll, I'll read the third oh, one, yeah. I guess. Uh, oh, number first three, off, find stores with large parking lots. Oh, I was going to say, first off, that man has a vision. Stand yeah, I know. He's, tall. It's a shame that nothing else around him has any vision, because it's blurry as fuck, and I can't make it out. Damn. I like that his head is like... Very small. It's like a grapefruit on the top of a of the Washington Monument. I like that his skateboard is floating because he's clearly not gripping it. His thumb is. He's on not the gripping side. it, and it's also not on the ground. Yeah, he's not gripping <laughs> it, and it's not on the ground, so it's just a floating skateboard. Mm. I like how it has like no trucks. It's just got like two wheels, like it's a fucking old timey like go kart, <laughs> like yeah. a soapbox yeah. car. He's got a fucking soapbox car with a skateboard there. I believe that's just uh. Uh, two little soapbox wheels, uh, or four little soapbox wheels attached to Pickle Rick. Oh, kind of looks shit. like it, yeah. Yeah. Damn. <laughs> Turn myself into a skateboard, Morty. There, now am I cool? Yeah. Am I hip with the teens? Rick. Come on, Morty, use me to bust the sick of I'm tricks, I'm a skateboard, <laughs> Morty. What no. a hilarious goof. <laughs> It'll be really funny, Morty. Come on, let's do a 360. Truly, truly the height of comedy. How old is that reference now? That show came out like, is that reference, it's like, what, <laughs> four years ago, now? Yeah. Uh, Fuck like out of here. This <laughs> shit's so old. It wasn't even <laughs> funny, man. No. <laughs> Where was I? Oh, yeah. Ask the owner of the store if you could use their parking lot to skate after hours. Yeah, Mr. Walmart, please. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, Mr. Walmart. <laughs> Mr. Walmart, I need to use your parking lot. <laughs> John Best, heir to the best by fortune. 
I'm trying my best. I need to use your parking lot. I beg you. I'd like Jesus, escape. first I had to call my congressman. Now I have to track down the, the CEO, CEO and owner of, you know, yeah, John Best, kidding. Best Buy. Yeah. John Best. <laughs> Whose fucking, fucking permission name. do I have to get to skate this spot? Just tell me already. <laughs> You need to sign all these forms, and you need to get all these different for, like permissions. I mean, it's a it's a much more much more a much less violent alternative to who do I have to kill to skate here? Who do yeah, I exactly. have to ask to skate here? Yeah, true, true. What did these you say? Are, oh. What did you say before we started recording, Connor? Thank you. I will do what you tell me. <laughs> yeah, that was to the security guard thing. Yeah. Matt quoted it. Yeah. Ugh. These spots are great for beginners. You just need a large, flat place to practice. Oh, okay. Okay. Make sure the parking lot has a smooth asphalt and avoid large pebbles. Large pebbles? I mean, those are just called rocks. <laughs> large I would think pebbles? Pebble, a pebble is small. By definition. The fuck is a large pebble? A rock. <laughs> it's just a rock, isn't it? Yes. yes. The a, fuck? Well, a large pebble is slightly smaller than a small rock. Damn. Really? I would actually I think know. there's a bit of an overlap. Uh, <laughs> I mean, I listen, think there are it's probably not a, some not a, small rocks. Oh, this I is going to be the next. It's not a very precise. Are... It's not a very precise kind of you know scale thing. Can I just? I hate these fucking recaptures where it's like, click on all the ones that are large pebbles. <laughs> <laughs> click on all the ones that are small rocks. Like, fuck off! I don't know. I don't they, know what the they all look the fucking I would same. Argue. Google. God damn it, I would argue, isn't the fact that I would argue that this is a small pebble, uh, sorry, a large pebble and not a small rock, proof that I am not a robot. Yeah, fuck out of here, Google. Google. Some I very can't fucking tell which AIs one's a large days. pebble, which one's a That's small true. rock. Let me fucking post. <laughs> <laughs> I just want to access this website. Always be careful when skating in parking lots, even empty ones. <laughs> I feel like I mean, that's a, just be careful when skating. Well, I mean, like, in, a, in an empty parking lot, you may not see any cars, but I don't know, from the darkness One of vampire, approaching. a vampire might jump out and just fucking kill you. <laughs> yeah, like, they anything could be approaching, really, I guess. Like, they cars. Will sneak up on you, my dude. Yeah. yeah. Oh, in the parking lot, you do have to worry about approaching cars. <laughs> yeah, they're gonna come after you. Very slowly. Keep an eye out for cars and pedestrians. Mm-hmm. <laughs> Bring a buddy when skateboarding in unfamiliar areas. <laughs> ah, skateboarding via the buddy system. Yeah. I mean, yeah, yeah. Yeah. I just. Good to watch your back, you know. I feel like you should just have that in general, like not just when I'm in a parking lot. Not just in unfamiliar areas, maybe also in familiar areas. Make sure that there are people around so that if something happens, there are people around. <laughs> Honestly, Bring a buddy oh, everywhere you go. Develop a lifelong friend for life. Yeah, oh, if you can't, yeah. if you can't into, just but... get like somebody to legally, you know, basically they need to orbit you like an electron. Yeah, yeah. yeah. I mean, Bob, that's what you and I did. You know, you for a went long time, yeah. literally everywhere I went. Mm-hmm. He would go to yeah. the bathroom. He would be in the shower. He would uh-huh. be in bed. Um, and I Bob can't. was just there. I was just there. Yeah, frequently spooning. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm. <laughs> yeah. Anyways. And now we're best friends. And now we're best friends. <laughs> yeah. After Before, after all that. Yeah. After, after that. all that, we became best friends. Before that, we were just <laughs> coworkers. Interestingly mm-hmm. enough, the best friendship is completely unrelated. That has a different cause. Yeah, totally unrelated. It was when I hit a kid with my car, and he went over. <laughs> it's a whole thing. Don't worry about it. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Uh, you want to hit us with this next one, which... Well, first I want to note is this flying person. Oh, yeah. Yeah, they're yeah. not... It's not like they all eat. They're just flying. That's a bird. Yeah, it's, they're just flying. Is it a bird? Is it a plane? Or is it a skateboard? <laughs> well, you know, Whoa. to quote Dio from uh, JoJo, with enough practice, human beings can, you know, teach themselves to fly. Yeah. I do well, like. He fucking said that. There's so many things about this that I really like. Like, for example, the, oh no, enough training. Sorry, enough training. They I, could fly. I, I I really like how she has a 30 foot wingspan. Mm-hmm. <laughs> uh, I also like that the trees, some of them are very well defined, and some of them are totally undefined. I half expect Slenderman to step out from behind those trees. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> What's that? Is that back there? Is yeah. that Slenderman? Is that is Slenderman that right John back there? Slenderman. He's back there. Look at him. There he is. Is that yeah. Mr. Slenderman? 
I Is like that Mr. That, Slenderman? Like, I have a feeling that the picture... Like, okay, so you know everybody... I don't know if this is a secret. I guess I'll just whisper it into the mic in case anybody doesn't know. Wiki how traces a lot of these pictures. Um, a lot of people don't know that, but the I think the top half of her body was traced from a different image than the bottom half. Is that? Oh, I could a, see that because yeah. the because way the the, the way her, her hip. hips are like not yeah. lined up at all. Yeah, with yeah, the top that was, that was half. Bad. I think the top half was somebody who was jumping off of like. A small, like, you know, like, landing or something. And the bottom half was, like, maybe somebody sitting with their feet up. And then they just drew in freehand, like, <laughs> whatever that little slip of paper pretending to be a skateboard is. Yeah. Yeah. I like yeah. also how, despite being not not about not the same distance, except maybe for, like, the teeter-totter, um, like... <laughs> Everything, like everything, also those things are like far away, like the playground yeah, equipment. The, the but it's completely is far not away, like you're trying to get your kid killed by Slenderman. Like, <laughs> well, Slenderman put it back there. He moved it back there. It like, oh, it's part of his it's dastardly like, plans. This seems like a kindergarten a where bit. it's like you know you get to you go down the slide and then you have to take a long walk over to the swing set. And regardless, nobody hangs out with the kids on the teeter totter. Like the teeter totter <laughs> lays sits there with cobwebs, and then like. <laughs> <laughs> They're like the kids bully the the loser kid into going over there, and then like suddenly Slenderman steals the kid away. <laughs> Damn! <laughs> well, that's anyway. the beginning of Slenderman two. The re- the, the rise. slendering. Oh, the slender. The slendering. Yeah. Slenderman the two. The uh, The skinny. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> anyway, step four. The slendering. Skateboard through a public park. Choose a park with large <laughs> paved bike trails. Skaters usually have to follow the same rules as bikes. Stay to the right when skating. Pass on the left only when there aren't any oncoming bikers or pedestrians, and alert the person in front of you if you're passing. Double check with your local government to make sure you're allowed My to skate here. My local government? This information yeah. can be found online or by calling your local police department. Yeah, what 911. Am I allowed to skate here? <laughs> Bro, how many you, you're making, people do I have to call? They usually have fucking signs out. You know that, right? You could. There's a sign normally that just says no, no, no skateboarding no, no. allowed. Nah, this, you don't have to fucking call the cops. You can just look. This wiki how is for squares, dude. You, you gotta, <laughs> dude. You gotta have like a long list of people. You gotta get permission from yeah. like your fourth grade teacher and like yeah, Santa and Claus. Like every single person you've ever Bunny. heard of has to check off on this God, before yeah, you can one- start skateboarding. One thing I just noticed is that every single step before this has had at least something with a reference. Mm. Nah, they made this not one this up. one. This one is completely freestyling it. Yeah, yeah. John, uh, John the point, John D is what I'm gonna call him. John, yeah, John D, D saw this step and went, <laughs> Ugh, "I can't vouch for that, dude." Public you know, parks. I'm also who not knows? gonna vouch for it because there were like paved uh, stuff at my park, and that shit was like so boring to skateboard. Well, yeah. It was awful. Yeah. I never, I mean, like, I only skateboarded there once, and I was like, I'm never going back there again. <laughs> I mean, it does say here to skateboard through it. So you just go through yeah. it once, and then you're done. You're done. Yeah, I thought that was a weird way of, of uh, wording that, too. Skateboard through yeah. your local park. Yeah. <laughs> In one side, out the other. Yeah. yeah. Just go through it on your way to elsewhere, I guess. Um, I don't want you guys to scroll down just yet. I just want you to brace yourselves, because this next picture is the reason I thought... We should cover this. Uh-huh. Okay. Connor? All right. Well, method two, finding unusual skate spots. Yeah, I found so, something unusual. Yeah. yeah. Mm-hmm. No, there's so, definitely something unusual here. Yep. So once again, that incredibly paper-thin skateboard, missing some wheels. <laughs> yeah. Her, yeah. Being bendy yeah. as hell. Her bending at a ridiculous pad. angle. What pad. are they doing? Pad that doesn't elbow fit. Pad that is stupid. What yeah. the fuck is going on? The more I look, the worse it gets. Yeah. My <laughs> fucking think... fingers are the same color as the fucking ground back there. I think. Yeah, they kind of just gave up there. Yeah, I think what's supposed to be happening is this dark smudge is the inside of a bowl, and she's grinding along the edge. That's not or an something? unusual skate spot. Maybe. Anyway. Yeah, like she went up and is grinding the lip. 
Yeah, yeah. I think that's supposed to what happened, but the skateboard is apparently made of, like, pla- paper or something, because yeah. they're not supposed to bend like that. Definitely yeah. not supposed to bend like that. Maybe it's made of plastic, and like a weird Even plastic if this was a perfectly done image, and, like, I assume the colors in the background are the graffiti, but, like, t- this isn't an unusual skate spot, this is just a skate park. This is step one of method one. Yeah, find oh, a skate I just noticed your fucking skate. fingers back there, look at them! Uh-huh. Oh. oh my god! It's like oh. a noose. They didn't even try! It's just like a noose on the end of her wrist. And all it of really it... It really does look like that, doesn't it? All of it is topped off by that incredibly smug expression. Yeah. Oh, man, she's so smug right now, man. <laughs> like, yeah. holy shit. Loving this shit. She knows right, that so. she's on top of the world with her weird plastic paper skateboard. And her singular <laughs> and elbow And her weird pad. yoga pose. Yeah, yeah. So... Yeah, step one, drive around your neighborhood. This is the best way to find interesting skate spots. Uh, citation needed. What well, the there fuck? is a citation to a citation YouTube video. Let me see this. Like, research sources a YouTube video? How to find skate spots the easiest way tutorial. Braille? <laughs> what the fuck, Braille? And it automatically links to 36 seconds in. Yeah, it links to 30, what, let's yeah. see what 36... Oh, yeah, Aaron, whatever your fucking yeah, name Mr. is. Yeah, Mr. Braille few... himself. Yeah. <laughs> Okay. He literally uh, just says, get in your car and drive everywhere. Like, that's... that. Their yeah. citation is literally what it... Yeah. Well, yeah. I'm, no, he uh, said yeah. drive everywhere. This one says drive around your neighborhood. I'm going back to the article now. Yeah. Look for concrete areas with stairs, handrails, and ramps. Mm-hmm. <laughs> the ramps are really... Yeah, deal- built-in <laughs> ramps. <laughs> When you find a good spot, take a picture with your phone and record the address. You'll be able to easily find the spot again. Nice. Okay. Yeah, um, that that is that how very much depends on your on sense your of direction, but mm-hmm. and then drive around at different times of the week to see what times your favorite spots are empty. Two a.m. Sure. No. Yep. My name Convenient. is Rodney Mullen. Three a.m. Yeah. skateboarding is what I do. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Well, numero two as the mm-hmm. as the Spanish say, mm-hmm. uh, we got uh, another picture. Uh, I don't know. I I mean. Given what we've seen in the previous pictures, this is kind of just on brand the for them at ag- this point. Least egregious yeah. one so far. Yeah. Not saying it's good. Not with their fucked up white what skateboard is, there in the what middle. Is, okay. Not with I'm, a fucked up blue skateboard either. I'm noticing, what I'm noticing is the guy with the, the blue skateboard, his legs. Yeah, people have evolved longer legs as well. Well, actually, yeah. it's longer shins because, like, yeah, his but the right calf leg is incredibly has- short. Yeah, his calf oh, is about that. three or four inches long, and the rest of his leg is all shit. Oh, oh my <laughs> god, I just realized that. Jesus! The more you look at it, the more... Like, I mean, imagine if you I saw someone this. approaching you with legs like that. It's just, oh. I want you to just imagine you're standing somewhere, maybe on a college campus, or like, a, you know, in, in, at work, and you see somebody walking down the hall, and their knees seem to bend... Like, pretty much where their hands, in their, like, they put their hands in their pockets, and they are grabbing their knees. Oh, no, I did not need that mental image. Oh, man, I don't like that. God damn yeah. it, Bob. And then it's just stick legs from there. Oh. Well, number two, get to know your local skaters. I mean, you'll never forget that guy. No, that guy. <laughs> you'll get to know him, all right. Will, yeah. His existence will be seared into your brain. Yeah. Join a skating group or try to make friends with skaters you meet around town. If you're of legal drinking age, find out what bars in your area are skater bars. These skaters mm-hmm. will have valuable information on where to find skate spots. However, if you're not friends, they may not want to share it with you. You first need to you <laughs> yeah. see you first need to level up your social link and then you get the yeah. uh, you know the access to the special area. Real yeah. life is just a persona game. Yeah, yeah. exactly. See, you say that, I immediately went to Oblivion, where you have that weird little circular mini game oh, yeah, with yeah. the wedges, and it's just like coerce, admire, boast, and whatever, and like you just yeah. do that four or five times, and then they feel happy enough to, to give, tell yeah. you the secret skate spots. Have you heard of the high elf skate <laughs> yeah, I'm just sky elf skate spot. I'm just walking around and some random guy stops me and heard of like, have you seen the skate spots in White Run? <laughs> and I'm like, I didn't even fucking ask. <laughs> you probably don't skate in the Cloud District very often. I used to be yeah. a skateboarder, just like you. 
But then, you know, the incident. <laughs> then yeah. I took a truck to the knee. Oh. To the knee. It approached on me. <laughs> the car approached me. <laughs> you must be careful. The cars approach at night on these paths. <laughs> Have you seen... Dude, wait, wait. I got the perfect one. Have you seen those guys from Hammerfell? They've got curved boards. <laughs> Damn. <laughs> curved boards. Curved <laughs> boards. God damn it. We're uh, fucking boomers. Uh, We're just sitting here making yeah, Skyrim. Po- post some more Elder Scrolls line turned skateboarding in the comments. The, el- the Elder Boards. Yeah. Oh yeah. The the <laughs> if you ride one of them, you'll die. <laughs> <laughs> well, you see, the, the you trick ride, is when you ride it, yeah. you can see the past and future. God, I just want the, the trick with the elder board is you have to do a trick like perfectly. If you don't land the trick, then you just immediately fucking die. Yeah, you can just get kimmed away. But if you land the trick, then you gain the knowledge. Yeah, that's exactly. what happened to the dwarver. <laughs> Yeah, you find these ancient skate parks, but who built them and where are they? Whoa! <laughs> what happened to all the people who built these things? Oh, man. Oh, my God. Get to know local skaters. Join in the, yeah. Um, watch videos of local skaters doing tricks on the internet. Keep an eye out for familiar landmarks to help you figure out where they are. Ah, Honestly, dude. I feel like it'd be easier to find local skaters by watching videos online and using landmarks to find your way like right like like how do yeah. you know that you're watching videos of local skaters without knowing where they are i'm just thinking like let's say you live near the washington monument i think you're more likely to find local skaters by just searching skate video washington monument than you are to just find a video of a local skater that you know is Somehow. local, but you don't know where, and then you see in the background the Washington Monument. Yeah, yeah. yeah. And you, you know, go, oh, I know where that. they are. Like that, I don't understand how this works. How are you supposed I, to... I did search skate videos, like, my area, and I did find, like, a skate video, and I knew the area they were skating at, right, because like, I'd been there to Like, that's, that's the whole way you identify, like... like like for example, my my family, uh, my my parents now live in Santa Cruz, California, and I go out and visit them sometimes. And when Get Out or not Get Out, uh, Us, Jordan Peele's other movie, um, Us was in theaters, I went and saw it, and I was like, oh wow, I recognize some of these places because it was filmed in Santa Cruz, right? Yeah, but yeah. like, I like this because I knew they filmed in Santa Cruz. Yeah. Yeah. Like we, you're more, we get it. I don't know. Whatever. We get it. We get it. <laughs> All right. Step Trez. Use the skateboarding app. Apps such as We Ride Skate Spots allow skaters to bookmark great skate locations in their cities and share them with the rest of the skating community. These apps are free to use. However, use your best judgment when choosing the skate spot. Not all skaters are concerned about breaking laws. Uh, well, um, wait, not all skaters are with the tone of the article being really like you should follow the law I feel like that sentence you know should have been not all skaters are concerned with you know following the following law following them yeah no yeah. not all of them are concerned also, with breaking you know, them some of them want to follow the laws not all of them want to break it I get it. on the skate app and I go great skate mate I rate 8-8 <laughs> eight, eight. it <laughs> makes it sound like you need to be careful about the ones that like suggest skate spots that are within the law doesn't it yeah, <laughs> yeah. yeah it, you don't want to be yeah, a square it though does. So. yeah you don't want to be a square watch out some of these may be legal skate spots yeah, you might find some losers who, like, call their congressmen and police to uh, <laughs> verify they could skate at these spots. If you don't have a smartphone, many of these apps also have websites that you can use. Cool. I feel Thanks. like you should point to websites first and apps second, but okay. You think? Yeah. I don't know. A lot of young people have smartphones these days. Yeah, I know. I I, I guess I'm just old where I'm thinking yeah, of websites before I think yeah, of apps. Yeah. yeah, I'm the same way. I think of websites first, but I recognize that I'm an old man with arthritis, and I'm going to die next year, so... Yeah. Uh, Fingers shit. crossed, huh? Fingers <laughs> crossed. <laughs> All right. Well, moving on. Three. Or method three, sorry. Oh, yeah, moving right, on yeah, to method three. 
I said three because I can speak English good. Finding a skateboarding route. Ooh. Ooh, a whole route, you say? Yep. Nice. This will help. Step one of method three. Wait, this Find... picture, real quick, this picture mm. is... Um... Is the sidewalk on fire? That's why he's in the road. Yeah. Oh, okay. The wheels aren't even connected. He yeah, oh somehow my God. has an alpine skateboard. It's only raised <laughs> on one end. Actually, no, that? that's a snowboard, and those are dumbbells. I was about to say the same <laughs> thing. Yeah, I saw yeah. that too. Oh, um, question, though. Is he facing us or facing away? Uh, yes. I would think those are the back of his shoes we're looking at. Yeah, that's what I was thinking, but like... Yeah, and that's his butt. Like, but his hands are... Uh, not helping that. Yeah, the hands aren't helping. They can really go either way because we're not getting a sense of where the palms are. And that's not much of a butt. No, but you know, some people have a tiny butt. I have yeah. barely a butt. Not all of us can have a big dump truck ass. Like yeah, me. I like I like my skateboarders thick. Yeah. <laughs> oh, okay. Well, borders. <laughs> I'm sorry, this is not a thick skateboarder. I mean, how I'm would you feel if you were skateboarding around, finding your route, and then someone shouted out, like, they just decided to catcall you. They were like, nice ass! Like, <laughs> like mean, you do, like, a sick trick. And everyone's like, like, whoa, holy shit. And then someone goes like, dude, what a dump truck ass. Like, I thought you were going to do, like, say you do a sick trick, and everyone's like, dude, what a dump truck ass. <laughs> Nobody cares That's about the trick response to your all. sick trick. You do, like, a fucking 900 or some shit, and it's yeah. like, Nice Whoa. ass! Holy <laughs> shit, you got a great ass. Yeah, you do an 1800 from a standing position, like me, and, uh-huh. uh, well, I mean, I guess they won't say dump truck ass, they'll probably just say, I'm blind. <laughs> <laughs> That's what happens when you see me do the 1800 from a standing position. Oh, when you do the blank tester. Uh Mm -hmm. You know, actually, now that I think about it, we never had a name for that trick. I thought it was called the blank tester. No, the blank tester is where you you fall on the ground nose and knees first. Oh. Oh. I did that on a slippery sidewalk just the other day. Oh, I'm so sorry. I had to make sure you could still do it after all this. Exactly, yeah. I fell because it was slippery, and then luckily my my face and knees broke my fall, so... Yeah. I'm I'm A-OK. You you know, Tony Hawk just did a 720 at the age of 52, but, like, you'll be doing the blank tester through your entire life, like when you're in a nursing home, you know? You will die doing the blank tester. Probably. I imagine what will happen... uh, it will either be I will die doing the blank tester or I'll do the 1800 from a standing position as an old man and I'll spin in place and all my organs and bones will s- just fly all over the room. It'll be like <laughs> I just exploded and there will be nothing Damn. left of me. Damn. Because I'll, it'll just be all my tendons and ligaments won't hold together anymore. Mm-hmm. Well, as, you, as we always say, fingers crossed. Fingers crossed, yeah. Find smooth sidewalks and streets on your route. If possible, choose surfaces with low-grade asphalts. This will help you avoid hitting rocks and falling. Uh, are we hitting rocks now and not large pebbles? What the fuck? <laughs> well, yeah, we're, we've got more skateboarding skills. We're moving on to the next level. Uh-huh. Damn. You've got to avoid the big rocks now. One day you'll have to avoid the, ho- the boulders. Boulders, yeah. avalanches, yeah. mountains... <laughs> Swerve around older parts of the road to stay on newer parts of the road. Wow, is that how that works? Huh, I'll be goddamned. Holy fucking shit. Hmm, maybe wow. skate on higher quality road. Weird. And that way you can avoid the lower quality road. Mm-hmm. Whew, keep really in mind that... Keep in mind that may be illegal in your city to skateboard on the street. Coward. Make sure you call up your local congressman and you find out. <laughs> Coward. <laughs> Never hitch a ride by grabbing onto the back of a car, also called skitching. This activity is incredibly dangerous and can lead to fatalities. That's you fair. know, I went to Google that to see if it was a thing outside of Tony Hawk, and it turns out it is. Like, yeah. it's, it goes way back. I never knew that. Because yeah, I'd only it, never yeah. seen it in Tony Hawk and, like, skate, and I didn't know it was a real-life thing that people really did. 
<laughs> yeah, you, you know, with things like this, yeah, you might worry, like, oh, what are video games teaching our children? You know, they teach your kids that you can jump off a roof and do, like, a triple front flip and land and be fine. But no, here, it, sketching is useless in Tony Hawk. Nobody does yeah, it. Yeah, nobody like, ever I want did to it. do this in real life. No. You don't have to worry there. Yeah. yeah. Sketching snuck. Sketching sucks. gets you, like, no points. I've never integrated sketching into a combo. I can't and you? I like, every time I try to get out of a combo, like... Or it's like sketch out of a combo, which yeah. stops my fucking combo. Yeah, I like I tried, you know, when I was doing videos for all the Tony Hawk games, and I, it just I never happened. It was never worth it. Yeah, I, I mean, sketching in the, the Tony Hawk games seems to just be used for like goals. single missions, single missions yeah. or goals where it's like, oh, we need you to sketch on this thing in order to get enough speed to get to do something else. It's funny that they introduced it in Tony Hawk's Pro Skater 4, because that one had the least, like, car levels in it. Really? And okay. the smallest, like, roads. Like... Yeah. <laughs> and it was in, like, Underground that also had, like, the, the smallest of roads. That must have been a last-minute addition, I think. Yeah, yeah I, mean. I don't know. Like, all of them had small roads. Like, there was nowhere to even sketch to or from. <laughs> like, Tony Hawk's Pro Skater 2 in, like, Philadelphia had this big, long-ass road. But no, Could have yeah. sketched on that, maybe, but, like, not Tony Hawk's Pro Skater 4. Use Google Maps to help you chart a good course in advance. Thanks. Yeah. Wow. It's so it's so weird to get like actual decent advice in here. I never know how to respond. <laughs> yeah, I don't know. Um. <sighs> all right. On to the next step. Oh, yeah. when you replace one of your legs with a backpack. <laughs> yeah. yeah, and Blast when you when that happens, when you decide to go to infinity. <laughs> yeah, like that 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 road is just not ending. Mm-hmm. Right. Yeah. What's that? Uh, what's that? Um. Oh, what is it? Also, that art thing. I can't remember what it's called. Like lines of perspective or whatever. Oh, uh, one where it's like the vanishing point or whatever. Yeah. Like he's going to the vanishing point. Yeah, I do like that. The it seems like the vanishing point is is actually like as you get further and further towards it, the bike lane becomes more and more of the road. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, but also like yeah, especially like the the lines be, just become thicker mm-hmm. as mm-hmm. it goes along because they they appear the same thickness nearby as far away. So yeah, so when it's you amazing get how they closer, got the, like, it's, like the, a... it's kind of amazing how they got like the perfect like widening of the of the stripe to make it appear uh-huh. perfectly straight. Yeah. Guys, I don't think Damn. these lines are parallel. Yeah. Uh huh. I don't think I don't think they're parallel lines, no. No. Um so use the bike lane. If your city has bike lanes on the road, use them. Okay. I feel like that's bad advice. That is bad advice. Bike, especially like, he- bikes. especially here in the Netherlands, where most of those lanes are specifically bicycle lanes, the bicyclists will murder you. Oh yeah, no, they'll do that here too. But that's Genuinely yeah. they will the choke you to death. Not. Let because me, that yeah, no, the is bicyclists here will just kill you no, for no. the fun of it. Like, you know, I'm I'm I feel bad out there for all the skateboarders, but like no, riding your skateboard is not the same kind of thing as like, you know, riding your bike around. Please like, don't you do this. should not take up the bike lane. Um yeah. I'd like to don't. just tell a, a really short story uh about uh an old roommate of mine, not Connor, obviously. Um but uh, uh, what a weird name! Yeah, is the I'm not I'm not gonna say his name. His his but, name is not Connor. That was his no. Name. We'll just call him uh, uh Bleven. Uh, Bleven. The name I've decided to give him. Uh, his name's not <laughs> Stephen. Uh, so Bleven, uh, I lived with uh, for a little bit, and I one time just asked him, like I was just out of curiosity. I didn't know the answer. I was just like, uh, you know, why why do they start putting bike lanes in? Like, why don't bikes just ride on the sidewalk and his response was well it's illegal for bikes to ride on the sidewalk because bikes can go as fast as cars up to 45 miles an hour which why there's a number of things wrong with what was what? said what <laughs> fucking guy <laughs> what yeah. Connor, you know, I know who i'm talking, talking about, about. Yeah. yeah yeah he would uh, he had this habit of just lying. I've told other stories about this roommate before. Uh, is in this habit of just lying about shit when he didn't know what he was talking about? Uh, and so like he was. I mean, just the idea that the re- it's illegal for bikes to drive on to ride on sidewalks because 
they can go as fast as cars. And then he said up to 45 miles. If you're riding a bike at 45 miles an hour, like a bicycle at 45 miles an hour, uh, you, you're going to be screaming. <laughs> uh, you're going to die. Yeah. yeah. Like, your <laughs> eyes are going to dry out if you're not wearing goggles. You're going to die. You understand it's that. It's going right? to be so fucking uncomfortable. You're either going to die or become a champion. <laughs> uh, Maybe both. Yeah. Yeah. All right. So, uh, use the bike lanes. These lanes are generally well maintained and provide a smoother surface for skateboarding. Furthermore, pedestrians and cars aren't allowed in this lane, so you won't have to worry about running into them. But you will have to worry about running into bicyclists. Yeah. Keep in mind that some cities have laws against skateboarders using the bike lane. For good oh, fucking oh, reasons, guys. Guys, hmm. guys call your happen? local police department <laughs> oh, to find God. out whether or not you could do this, yeah. bro. This gotta be an easy way to check the fucking laws and calling up my police department Dude, after this every article single wants fucking you to be, one of them. This article wants you to be such a square, you've gone straight to Tesseract. Yeah. Oh this article was written by, like, someone who works at Verizon. It's like... <laughs> you know, like money every time you call! Bring, bring phones back and make sure to sign up for our plan! <laughs> <laughs> God. <laughs> they make a commission every time you make a call as recommended by this article. Yeah. Yeah. As soon as the police, you know, as soon, you know the, the, the police officer who takes the phone call, like, has to, like, find out down where you got the, got their number. Yeah. Yeah. Has to, well, first off, not even you know, their number, just has, the has recommendation to, to call. That's the first kind of sit there, like, oh, okay, this is a skating question. Very important question about that. Where did you get the idea to <laughs> ask this question to me? Wiki, how great. Let me just note that. <laughs> Let down me just note system. that down. I need to make a call after. Okay. This. What was your question? Yeah. <laughs> uh, so stay on the right side of the lane while skating. If you need to pass someone, pass on their left. Make sure to warn them as you approach by yelling, on your left. Hey, you know what, Yellow? I actually have a, a genuine question for you. Yeah. Not a meme. Uh, mm. Is it different in Europe? Because, like, we drive on the right side of the road, and you guys drive on the left side, right? <laughs> Okay, Not a meme. All... Is it, yeah, is this that... is a very American-centric I, article. Yeah, is that true? Like, I'm not wrong I mean... on that, right? Um, you are in fact wrong. Oh, most you... of in fact most of Europe does ride on the. It's mostly the UK. Oh, okay. Um, yeah. The, yeah. De the only two, definitely the only two that. countries that I can think of that where left side of the road is normal are the UK and Japan. Really? Okay. I think most other countries in I the world, Germany. it's the right huh. side of the road. See, when I was a kid, yeah. I was always taught that it was like everywhere but the U U.S. And then, like when I went to India, I was like. Uh, oh, everybody just drives everywhere. Nobody gives a shit. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. No, like, like, you might as well road. not have lines on the ground. Like, nobody well, gives a shit at all. Yeah. Mm -hmm. no, My friend he, in Saudi Arabia said that's the way it is there, too. Yeah. <laughs> well, here, here in the Netherlands, people just right side of the road. That's most yeah. of Europe. Oh, okay. I thought for some well, reason I'd be Germany curious. had left side of the road. No, Germany is also right side. I'd oh, be curious well, be if done. in the UK, then, they, you know, you... You travel on the left and pass on the right, mm -hmm. rather than traveling yeah, on the right and passing on the left. Yeah. And then, uh. you know, the, and then, you know, if you're on your bicycle, because UK people also sometimes ride bicycles, I guess, they, yeah. instead of yelling on your right, you know, which you would then expect, just they will just, no, no, they will just, you know, <laughs> use their bicycle, like, use the bell on their bicycle. To make an annoying dinging noise. Coward. Huh. Yeah, the as you crash. Know, on a bicycle. <sighs> Obey no. all traffic laws when using the bike lane. Right. Like, especially the law that tells <laughs> you... Thank you, I will do what you tell me! <laughs> <laughs> especially the law that tells you you can't skateboard here. Thank you, I will do what you tell me! I'm trying to think of the next part of the song. <laughs> like, how to make that about <laughs> being polite to... <laughs> <laughs> to authority. Thank you. I will do what you tell me. Yeah. Some of those who ride skateboards are the same that something something. Yeah. I'm trying to think of that something something. Mm. <laughs> yeah. All right. Whatever. Yeah. Well, number one, three. One. One more. Yeah. Last step. Wear protective equipment. Oh my Sk god, mate! That. <clears throat> Shouldn't that be the first step? I. 
now that you know how to skateboard, you have graduated to wearing protective equipment. <laughs> yeah, like, wouldn't I take it off after I learned how to skate, not learn how to skate either, and put it on? Either, honestly, either, just based on this first bit, this either should not have been in this article because it's not directly related to what we're talking about, or it should have been step one. Yeah. yeah. I really gotta say, I, I kind of skipped over the, the artwork. Mm. There's lots of little de- Like, this is... I see yeah. why they didn't put in lots of detail before. Yeah. Because no, when they try, fine. it comes out really strange. You know, we asked, you know, were they even trying before? And we know, no, they weren't. And now we know, yes, they are. And we know that it's somehow worse. <laughs> yeah. This is them trying, and I w- liked it better when they didn't. Yeah. Um, yep. It somehow looks even worse than when they didn't try. Skateboards are great modes. Skateboards are great modes of transportation. I guess, yeah. Yeah, I mean, it's not like each skateboard is a different mode of transportation. They're all the same mode of transport. Yeah, skateboarding Mm. is a great mode. Yeah, yeah, whatever. Um, However, your chances of sustaining a serious injury are greatly increased when you don't wear protective equipment on an uneven surface. What about about even surfaces? If I wear it on an an even surface, I'm fine. Mm -hmm. I mean, if I don't wear it on an even surface, yeah. Unlike the skate park... The surfaces you'll be skating on will be irregular and can change unpredictably. They will Bro, morph I under your wheels. I myself at that skate park. You shut the fuck up. Yeah. <laughs> I almost died when I went to that skate park. I, I really I like, like can change I, unpredictably. Yeah, I like that too. What they mean is you'll be riding around and like you may hit a rough patch while you're riding forward. But the idea that the terrain itself can change is like, oh, okay, we're gonna just have like a fucking earthquake right now. Yeah, so no, that's the way it works. Yeah. Unpredictably, it morphs under the very wheels. You're of skateboarding, your skateboarding through a fucking uh, wipeout course. <laughs> yeah. yeah, yeah. Just suddenly, like a big hand just I'm comes up from through the floor, contest- <laughs> throwing you upward. Castle. God. What? <laughs> Protecting equipment includes Dude, helmets. Takeshi's defense. castle would make like the best skate park. Yeah. <laughs> uh, I'll just let me just Get run the fucking the show boulder quick. about the drop on me. Uh, <laughs> helmets, knee pads, elbow pads, and shin guards. This equipment can be bought at most sport department stores and skate supply shops. Yes. Um, okay, so this is a new thing from uh, WikiHow in the community Q and A. If you don't, uh, if you don't have a pro account. You don't get to see the expert answers. Which... Oh, you know what's great, uh... though? You know what's really great about these? If you, like, select these, you can unblur it. What? Oh, you're right. Like, click drag and select your unblur it. They didn't actually, like, block it out. Oh. oh they just blurred God. the text. You can just unblur it. And probably Damn, if you... block do... element? And look yeah, yeah. I was, about to si- I was about to check, too. Like, if we... Yeah, if you just you if you oh my god, you can block element and then just click and select, and I can read it now. Yeah, if you (laughs) click and drag carefully, you can just copy paste the text into it. Get fucked, Wiki Hell! You didn't even try. Oh man! Oh man! You know what? Hang on. Fuck Wiki Hell! I'm gonna read the answer so that you fucking kids out there don't have to do this. Wait, wait! Before you do that, I don't know that that doesn't constitute stealing. Hmm. I, didn't I don't think follow it does. What you guys did, so just tell me after this. <laughs> I'm concerned that that might constitute stealing. I mean, I'm not. I don't want to give money to WikiHow. That <laughs> like, come on! Everyone's complaining about Twitter, maybe asking you to pay for stuff, but imagine having to pay for WikiHow. <laughs> God, I mean, if people if people want to read this at home, just. You can select the text, just copy paste. I'm just gonna it into read, it. Like, and like, read it. Like, it's, like, it's, it's not like I did anything illegal to do this. I yeah, copied and pasted I guess, it. Okay, fine. Yeah. Okay. They so, didn't fucking try at all. Where if should they didn't I want get me my copy first and pasting it, They shouldn't have let me copy and paste it. It's, I, I don't think WikiHow is gonna sue us regardless. Oh, sue me. Where WikiHouse? should no, I get my first skateboard? John I'd love to see them fucking try. His hidden answer... Oh, wait, not hidden. Yeah. <clears throat> Go to a local skate shop and tell the clerk behind the counter that you're looking to buy your first skateboard. Oh, They'll walk you through all of the options and styles. Okay. Wait, yeah, that's well, where you should get your first skateboard. 
from the fucking skate shop. He very specifically says they'll walk you through all of the options and styles. So, like, yeah. yeah. I mean, that's not even a dig at John. Like, no. That's, I mean, where should you get a first skateboard? Where do you think? Yeah. Like, where else are <laughs> you going to get skate it? Shop. Uh, it's, that that answer is not worth five bucks or however much I'd have to spend. It's to two dollars, not worth it. two dollars. No, it's yeah. two ninety nine. It's three, three dollars. Imagine having per to month. fuck. Imagine fucking paying right and seeing that and just being like, "Wow." See, here's the thing, though. Nice, thanks. I Mickey can Hall. kind of see us as a group getting a pro account, and the reason <laughs> I think that might be a thing. Is so that we can just download the PDF of the article and then just scroll through that, so we don't have to do like a finagle a screenshot of WikiHow's thing. Yeah, that'd probably be easier, right? Oh, WikiHow's like, fucking elements that follow your screen as you scroll down break any screen capture. Yeah, so stuff. like three dollars per month, that might actually be a good investment for us. <laughs> All right, patrons, that's what your money's going for. Going <laughs> Maybe that's what we should do. We should actually probably talk to the patrons about that. Yeah. I, mean, I mean, granted, uh, they're almost certainly going to say, who gives a shit? Yeah, it's three bucks a month. Yeah, that's uh, one patron. <laughs> yeah. Oh, my God. Anyway, the rest the rest of this Q&A, the, let's see what other questions. Yeah, I mean, the rest of the questions are pretty, pretty, uh, yeah. pretty simple. Somebody's asking... If my dominant foot's supposed to be in front, but I prefer it in back, is that okay? He's asking if he can ride Goofy. Of course you can ride Goofy, my dude. You do whatever you gotta do. Yeah, just... You can ride Goofy, just don't push Mongo, or someone will kill you. Yeah. yeah. What do I do if I can't life. keep my balance while skateboarding on a road? You die. That's what happens. You just fall over dead. Um... And That's why you don't ever do that. They basically said practice on the carpet at home. Eventually you'll learn to get... You'll, you'll learn good moving <laughs> Wait, balance. What? And practice, like, practice being able to carpet? stand. Well, yeah. I mean, practice being able to stand when it's just not oh, moving. You know what? Actually, I'm gonna say, yeah. don't practice on your carpet at home. Don't do that. I mean, please. I mean, this is the only practice on uh, outside in your driveway or somewhere else. It's not your no, carpet no, at no, home. No, no way. As someone, Matt, as someone who picked up their first skateboard at the age of what 26 just to record some goof videos, um, skateboards. Turn to the left and right a lot more than you think they do. Yeah, but don't so, put yes, it on your fucking carpet. Yeah, put it on your carpet so, that, so you can stand yeah, up. Yeah, put it on your carpet, carpet so it doesn't move at all. And you can first okay, practice just balancing at. on it because that's harder than you think it is. Yeah. I, do, I think it's hard. I just also think that the carpet's like that. This is a way to mess your carpet up. No, your carpet's I guess you got your furniture carpet will on be it. fine. fine. Yeah. yeah. Eventually you'll learn good moving balance with prolonged stationary practice. Maybe have your inner ear checked out if balance does not improve. I do like this really square question here. Is it generally legal to skate in the street? You will be. die. Well, I mean, call the call your local police department. Have you not read the article, my dude? You're supposed to call everyone. You should get legal per- <laughs> written permission from every police officer working yeah. in your area every yeah. every like like both government of your bureaucrat. senators both uh-huh. of your senators all of your representatives of your state yeah <laughs> once you talk to the mayor and they give you the keys to the city uh-huh. then you could skate in the street honestly it may be a good idea for you to get a preemptive pardon <laughs> before you start skating <laughs> Just in yeah. case it does turn out to be illegal. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> well, oh otherwise, is there God. anything else? Is it, they put um, the tips and warnings still at the bottom. Yeah, so um, wear flat bottoms, flat bottoms shoes when skateboarding. Flat bottom shoes, you yeah. make the rocket <laughs> yeah. world yeah. go round. <laughs> <laughs> wow. <laughs> Take the time to learn to skate properly before learning tricks. Otherwise, you may seriously injure yourself. And it's more fun to skate slash learn to skate when you're doing it with friends. Sorry, kid. Uh, who's trying to learn tricks before they know how to skate? An idiot. Me, man. I wanted how to go straight do to doing, you know, the 900. But I, I wanted to bypass all of that again, like... Having to learn to actually stand on the board without falling <laughs> off, kind of stupid shit. You yeah, well, you want me to learn no, how to balance to first? I wanted to bust the sickest tricks. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. It's like trying yeah. to get into parkour before you can crawl. Yeah. <laughs> okay. Uh, and then warnings. 
Be aware of your local skateboarding Ooh. laws and avoid breaking the law. Otherwise, you'll have to pay hefty fines and may even face jail time. Wow. Damn. They man. really, oh. really needed us to know that. Always wear protective gear when skating. Yes. Yeah. Do that, please. That was please. one of the steps. Mm-hmm. There it is. There it is. Two people voted 100% on this. Yeah, yeah a whole two people found this very helpful. Oh, 19 people it. wrote this, two people found it helpful. Amazing. Well, there you go. Thanks for watching and supporting us, especially our Platinum D-Hole patrons, Dr. Faust, Hoshkoff, ODST795, Polly Hebert, and Stannis the Manus. In the description, you'll find our social links, as well as a Google form to submit your own viewer requests. Have a safe and happy 2021, and we'll see you next time. <laughs>